Good morning, everybody, and welcome to your English classes as usual. Okay, now, boys and girls, today it's a special day. Today it's your exam. Okay, today it's your exam. In our number one, our number one, we are going to remember the vocabulary and grammar about the present continuous about el más, el have, and a reading comprehension, reading comprehension, okay? And in our number two, you take, you do your exam, okay? Number, our number one, we remember our number two, you do your exam, okay? Your exam is easy, guys. So, let's start with the review. One, two, and three guys let me show you let me show you my powerpoints to remember the last class okay let's see let's see let me show you my powerpoint let's see guys <clears throat> melina mauricio iris and Anna Ellis. the last class the last wednesday we learn about el have to okay we learn about have to. Okay? Now, Melina, Mauricio, Anaelis, tell me, in what occasions, for what reason we use el have to? ¿Para qué utilizamos el have to? Para cosas prohibidas, creo. Um, almost, almost perfect, almost perfect. Almost perfect, Anaelis. Tell me, tell me. Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, Anaelis, Iris. For what we use el have to? For what? For what? Para reglas. Excellent. We use el have to to mention rules. Okay. We use el have to to mention rules. Okay. Remember, have to rules. Okay. Rules. Now, Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, Iris, el don't have to. For what? In what occasions we use el don't have to? For what? Para cosas no necesarias. Excellent. We use don't have to to mention that an action, an activity is not necessary. Okay? Let's see. El have to is a rule. Okay? We use el have to to talk about rules, reglas. And don't have to to talk about actions activities that are not necessary no necessary okay so let's see melina please help me to read this example melina let's remember i have to get up at seven every day thank you okay i have to get up get up okay at seven it's a rule because you need to take your breakfast take a shower and then virtual classes it's a rule okay for example Anaelis, please help me to read this example Anaelis. leo yes please she she has to speak um speak in english at work at work thank you she has to speak english at work or in class okay here in english classes is a rule to speak English, no Spanish, no Japanese, no Portuguese is a rule to speak English. Okay, so we use el have to for rules. Okay, and don't have to to mention that is no necessary. Okay, no necessary. Okay, for example, Iris, please help me to read this example, Iris. She don't have to. Have to work on Saturday. Very good. She doesn't have to work on Saturday. Okay, it's not necessary to work on Saturday. Okay, so very good, guys. Let's see, guys. Please remember this. Okay, with he, she, and it, we say has to. Okay, he, she, it is has. To. Okay, he, she, it has to. I, you, we, they have to. Okay, let's see. I, you, we, and they, I, you, we, and they have to. He, she, and it 
has to. Okay, in affirmative, in negative, you say, I, you, we, they don't have to. And he, she, it doesn't have to. Okay, he, she, it doesn't have to. Okay, guys, so we are remember, yeah? Estamos recordando. Any question about it, guys? Do you have any question? Alguna pregunta? Questions? Yes or no? No? Okay, perfect. Let's continue to the next PowerPoint, okay? Let's remember, guys. Here, remember, we use el have to or el has to to talk about general obligations, okay? General obligation and it's 70% necessary, okay? It's a rule, but it's 70% so, so necessary, okay? So, let's complete to number one to number five, okay? Let's complete to number one from number five, guys. Let's see. Volunteer, please, to help me on number one. Volunteer, let's remember, guys. Volunteer. Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, Anaelis, Iris. Number one, we need to complete using el have to, has to, don't have to, or doesn't have to, okay? Excellent, Iris. Activate, activate your microphone, please, Iris. Yeah. I'm... Ah, lo digo? Yes, please, the complete sentence. I'm tired... I uh, have to go to bed early. Excellent, okay. I have to go to bed early. Thank you. Now, number two, it's in negative. Look, huh? number two is in negative. Now, volunteer to help me on number two, guys. Volunteer. Yeah. Okay, help me, please. Help me, Anaelis. Yeah. Uh, John, uh, come on. Ay, ¿Cuál era el negativo, profe? Ah, two options. Don't have to or doesn't have to. What is the correct, Anaelis? El primero. Don't o doesn't? Don't. Don't. Mm, are you... No, doesn't. 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 Ok. Tell me, tell me, Anaelis. John. John doesn't go to school on Saturday. Okay, John doesn't go to school or John doesn't have to? Have to. John doesn't have to, okay? Very good. Thank you so much, Anaeli. Thank you. Now, let's see, guys. Volunteer number three, it's affirmative. Huh? Let's see. Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, number three. Come on, guys. Let's remember. Wait. Thank you, Mauricio. We have to get another dog soon. Okay, perfect. Very good. Now, Melina, Stephanie, Anaelis, Mauricio, Iris. Excellent, Iris. Let's see. Number four, guys. It's affirmative. Huh? Very easy. Number four. Um, this is a great book. You have to read it. Excellent. You have to. Very good. Perfect. Now, number five. Number five. Very easy. Yeah? Number five. A soldier. A soldier. Let's see. Mauricio, Stephanie, Iris, Anaelis, Melina. Come on, guys. Very easy. A soldier has to obey the orders. Excellent. Has to obey the orders. Okay, very good. It's a rule. A soldier, okay, a soldier has to, is a rule to obey orders. Okay, obey orders. Very good, guys. So, very easy. Let's remember, okay? Let's remember this, guys. El has to, it's to talk about rules, reglas, okay? General rules, have to, affirmative, 
in negative is to say it's no necessary, no necessary, okay? I doesn't have to work on Saturday or, uh, or she doesn't have to study on Saturday. It's not necessary to study on Saturday or we don't have to wear the complete uniform in this school. It's not necessary to wear the complete, complete uniform. No, only the jacket. Okay? So, el don't have to, it's not necessary. Remember, he, she, and it has to. He, she, and it in negative doesn't have to. Okay, guys? Excellent. So, let's continue to the next PowerPoint. Okay? Let's see. Now, we have el más. Okay, más. Listen, guys, Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, Ana Elis, and Iris. We use más. For what we use más, guys? ¿Para qué utilizamos más? For what we use más? Más. Para, para reglas y obligaciones. Excellent. Most important to talk about obligations, ¿ok? El más is for obligations, ¿ok? 100% necessary, yeah? 100% necessary. Obligations. Ah, listen. El más is for obligations. Es para obligations. And have to, have to is for rules, reglas, okay? Rules, have to, and más is for obligations, okay? Obligations. Remember, 100% necessary. And mustn't, guys, mustn't in negative. For what we use mustn't? El mustn't. Mm, mustn't. Para prohibiciones? Excellent. We use mustn't in negative to talk about prohibition. Okay, prohibitions, prohibited. Okay, for example, when you go to a gas station, when you go to a gas station, you have a cigarette, okay, you have a cigarette, and you have the smoke, okay, and it's prohibited, okay, it's prohibited, prohibited. So we use mustn't to talk about prohibitions, prohibited, okay, and must to talk about obli. Obligations, okay? A strong, a strong obligation. A strong obligations, okay? Now, let's see. Iris, please help me to read this example. Iris. Iris. You must do your homework tonight. Thank you. Okay, thank you, Iris. You must do your homework. Huh? It's an obligation. Your mother say, hey, Mauricio Melina, you must do your homework. Si no el chicote, you must to do your homework. It's obligation. Okay? Now, for example, um, Stephanie, help me to read this example, please. I. I. Más. Por qué? To call her tonight. Tonight, thank you. I mustn't forget to call her tonight. Okay? A prohibition. For example, it's your mother's day, happy birthday, your, your grandma, happy birthday, your sister, happy birthday. So it's prohibited. It's a prohibition to forget, olvidarte, to call your mother, to call your your sister, your brother, your father to say happy birthday. Okay? So, must is for obligation. Mustn't is for prohibition. Okay? Prohibition. Now, guys, let's continue. Let's continue with the review. Let's see. As I told you before, must is for personal obligation and it's 
100% mandatory, ¿ok? 100% necessary. Let's see, guys. Here we have this, ¿ok? We need to complete with más or más en, ¿eh? We need to complete with más or más en. Let's see. Volunteer to help me on number one. Let's complete from number one to number... Number five, okay? Let's complete to, from number one to number five. Volunteer to help me number one, guys. Kate is ill. <coughs> Fever, stomach, <coughs> toothache, toothache. Your teacher. Tell me, tell me. Kate is ill, so she must, must see the doctor. Must see the doctor, perfect. Más si da doctor, es una obligación como en fever, estómago y coronavirus. Uf, es una obligación, ¿ok? Very good, Melina, very good, Iris on the chat. Now, volunteer number two, guys. Throw litter, a ah, botar basura. Throw litter. Volunteer, throw litter, ¿ah? For example, litter, ¿ok? Litter. Throw litter, okay? So, mass or massing? Is an obligation or is a prohibition to throw litter? You mustn't throw litter on the floor. Excellent. You mustn't. Very good, okay? You mustn't. Very good. Thank you. Mustn't. Now, let's see. Leslie, good morning. It is. Uh, Ana Elis, Stephanie, Mauricio, number three, volunteer to help me. Good morning, profe. Okay, tell me, tell me. You? You must my know in the library. Okay, okay, Stephanie, thank you, Stephanie, thank you. Uh, it is on the chat. You must make notes in the library. Almost perfect, right, Stephanie? It's an obligation to make notes. It's an obligation or it's a prohibition to make noise. Prohibition, perfect, Stephanie, prohibition. Now, for prohibition, is must or mustn't? It's mustn't, very good, okay? Remember, guys, remember here, please. Massen, prohibition, mass, obligation, okay? Very good, guys. Let me correct here. I made a mistake. Okay, here is massen. Massen, number two. And number three, it's massen as well, okay? Let me erase and write it here. Massive. Massive. Perfect. Now, volunteer to help me on number four, guys. Volunteer. Leslie, Anaelis, Melina, Iris, Stephanie, Mauricio. Number four. Number It's cinco. Rainy. It is raining. It is, tell me, tell me. He, it is raining, so we, um, a ver. So we, um, mass or massen? Massen. Ah, okay, we massen. Okay, we massen. Massen. K or Andreas. Okay, okay, thank you, thank you, Anaeli. Listen, uh, it's raining, okay, raining, raining, and we mustn't take our umbrellas. Mm, it's a prohibition or huh? necessary. Mustn't huh? Mustn't. Huh? Mm, two options, Anaeli. Mustn't or must. Is an obligation to take the umbrella or is a prohibition? Uh, obligation. 
Excellent, so excellent. Uh, it is on the chat. So, mustn't or must? Mustn't. Must. Okay, remember, must is affirmative. Mustn't is negative. Okay, very good. And last but not least, number five, guys. Help me, help me. Melina, Stephanie, Anaelis, Leslie, Mauricio. This is a secret. This is a secret you must send to anybody. Excellent. Thank you, Melina. Thank you, Mauricio. Thank you. You mustn't, okay? It's a secret. Okay, it's a secret. You mustn't. Prohibition. Prohibited to tell anybody. Okay? Very good, guys. So, we have remembered. We have remembered el mas versus el mas. Okay? Do you have any questions, guys? Any questions, questions? Yes or no? No? Yes? No? Okay, perfect. Let's continue to the next PowerPoint. Okay? Let's continue. Remember, el mas is for personal obligation. El have to is for general, general rules, general obligation. El mas is 100% necessary, is 100% important, and have to is 70%, okay? Mas, 100% important. El have to is 70%, okay? El mas en its prohibition, mas en its prohibition, prohibited, and don't have to its no necessary, okay? No necessary. Remember, el más, it's more important. It's more important, más importante, okay? El más o el más. More is stronger than have to. Es más fuerte que el have to, okay? Now, let's see, guys. Here, we complete the last class, this activity, okay? I told you that these activities were necessary to complete on your notebooks. So guys, tell me, we remember el have to and we remember el must. Do you have any question about it, guys? ¿Alguna pregunta? Yes or no? ¿Solo se pone en el examen, profesor? No, 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 no. Let's remember very quickly el present continuous, okay? Very easy. Let's remember el present continuous, okay? For you, the present continuous is extremely easy because we have studied the present continuous a lot. Lo hemos aprendido, uff, practice a lot, okay? Let's see, guys. Give me a second here. Very easy, guys. Very, very easy. Volunteer to tell me a present continuous sentence about this boy. Volunteer, present continuous, present continuous. Affirmative. Come on, guys. Very He's running. Excellent. Repeat, please, Melina. He is running. He is running. Excellent. Present continuous. Excellent. Volunteer to tell me he is running, but in negative. In negative. Volunteer to tell me in negative. He is running in negative. Come on, guys. It is Melina, Naelis, Stephanie, Mauricio. He, he, he isn't running. He isn't running. Very good. He isn't running. Excellent. So here we have an affirmative sentence. Here we have a negative sentence. And last but not least, volunteer to tell me this, but in question, in question, in interrogative. Is he running? Is he running? Is he running? Very good. Is he running? It's a question. Okay, okay. Okay, Anaelis, don't worry. No te preocupes. Is he running? Very good, guys. Perfect. So, we are remembering the present continuous, okay? The verb to be in ing. Okay? Let's see, guys. Next, let's continue. Volunteer, please, to help me about, let's see, this girl. Volunteer to make 
to create, to invent a present continuous sentence about a year. Come on, Stephanie, Leslie, Iris, Mauricio, Ana Elis, Melina, about this year. This is eating very good, perfect. It's a pig. Very good. Now, Melina, Ana Elis, Leslie, Mauricio. She is not. She is not. Eating very good. She is not eating. Okay. Excellent. Thank you, Mauricio. She is not eating. Okay. Remember, you have two options. The name of two options. Is not that or or isn't. Okay. Isn't it's the short form? Is not is the long form. Okay, thank yeah. you. Now tell me, tell me, question, Mauricio. In question, she, yeah, excellent, Mauricio. Thank you. Is she yeah, very good? Thank you, Mauricio. Thank you so much. Okay, so Melina, Mauricio, Iris, Stephanie, Leslie. We remember the present continuous, okay? So let's continue with the review. Continuamos con el review. Let me, let me erase it, please. Give me a second. Okay, bye-bye. Very easy, remember the verb to be, guys. Remember, please, I am. Remember, uh, do not make a mistake here. No se confundan. I am, he, she, it. Is we you uh, they are we you they are okay? Please don't forget it. He she it is we you they are. I am okay. I am. Don't forget it, please. The last class, some of you told me, teacher, I is teacher. I is no. I is no zero. I am, I am, he, she, it is, we, you, they are. Okay, don't forget it, guys. No se olviden eso, okay? So, do you have any question about the present continuous? Alguna pregunta, chicos, guys? Any questions? No, yes, yes, no, yes, 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 no, 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 no? Okay, excellent, guys. Let me see the chat, let me see the chat. Profe, canción Gear on the Red is in English. I don't know. <laughs> Stephanie, concentrate in the class, not in the music. Okay, guys. Perfect, okay? So, guys, let's see. We remember about the present continuous, el have to, 70%, the have to, 70% necessary. Okay, have to, affirmative. It's 70% necessary, is a rule. Don't have to, doesn't have to, it's no necessary, okay? No necessary. El más, it's 100% necessary, 100% obligation. El más and it's prohibition, a prohibition, okay? Now, Melina, Stephanie, Leslie, Anaelis, and Mauricio. Now, let's go to a reading comprehension part, okay? In the exam, in your exam, you will have a reading comprehension part. Van a tener una parte de comprensión, reading, okay? Comprensión lectora. So, let's practice, okay? Let's practice before the exam. Practiquemos, okay? And let's remember vocabulary about the school subjects. Y también recordemos vocabulary about school subjects. Okay? Let's see, guys. Here we have this reading. Reading comprehension. Okay? Reading comprehension. The name is School of Fame. Huh? This is the title. A school of fame. Okay? So, let's see. Iris, please, help me to read the first paragraph, please, Iris. And Stephanie, Leslie, Anaelis, Mauricio, Melina, pay attention to Iris, okay? Let's see, Iris. Help me, please, 
One, two, and three. La Guardia High School in New York is not like most schools. Sigo? Yes, continue, please. It's a famous school of music, art, and performing arts. Jennifer Anison and Pacino are just two of La Guardia. Past students who make a famous. So I'd like to go to such a school. Thank you. So what it like to go to such a school? Thank you, Iris. Now, Melina, please continue to paragraph number two. Students at La Guardia study art, music, dance, and tears, but they must also do all the normal school subjects such as English and math class at start at 9 and, and, and at 4. There are up to 10 class per day with a break of online four minutes between class students have at least three to studio class every day and six school subjects. Six school subjects, very good, thank you. Stephanie, please activate your microphone and help me to paragraph number three. One, two, and three. Help me please, Stephanie. No. Stephanie? ¿Me escucha? Yes, please. Repeat, please, Stephanie. Repeat. ¿Me está escuchando? Yes, yes. Ahora sí, ya. Yeah. La guardia a los pues, like every other school students short day y de cada in terms the bill and months email email via daily after their last class of the day they must raise way well and months show respect to teacher um other students yes. and of course they must know is nothing and where in the school just like ever Every often is full, leave, leave, um, la guardería, no, la guardería, <laughs> can't be so, oh, uh, demands, they assume students that they knew were hard okay, okay. if they, stop, 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 stop. You are here, Stephanie. You are in paragraph number three, not in paragraph number four. Estás aquí, no aquí. Okay, don't worry, Stephanie. I'm gonna read, okay? Thank you, Stephanie, thank you. Let's see, huh? La Guardia has rules, just like every other school. Students must show their ID card to enter the building, okay? To enter the building and must leave immediately after the last class of the day, they must dress, dress well, and must show respect to the teachers and other students. The students must not, not use cell phones or pagers or pagers in class or download descargar music from the school computers. And of course, they must not smoke everywhere 
in the school. Okay, now last but not least, Melina, help me please on the last paragraph, number four, one more time, please. Just like every other school's like a La Guardia can be told at times, the students know that they must work hard if they want to become the stars of the future, that's the praise of fame. Of oh, fame. Thank you, Melina. Thank you, Stephanie. Thank you, Iris. And Mauricio, Ana Elis, I hope you read the article. Espero hayan leído. Now, guys, listen. Here we have an article about La Guardia School. Okay, now, question for the most intelligent. One extra point. One extra point in 2025, and in 2025. One extra point. Listen. Where, where it's La Guardia High School? Where it's the Guardia High School? Where is the Guardia High School located? Where? Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, Anaelis, Iris. Where is La Guardia High School? Where? Come on, guys. That's a very easy question. Where is La Guardia High School? What is the meaning of where, guys? ¿Qué significa where? 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 Tell me, tell me in Spanish. What is the meaning of where, guys? ¿Qué significa where? <clears throat> Stephanie, Iris, Melina, Mauricio. Where? Where do you live? I live in Mega Plaza. Where do you work? I work in San Miguel. Where? Donde? Excellent. So, answer please. Where is La Guardia High School? Where is La Guardia? Major. Repeat please, Melina. Major. New York. Perfect. La Guardia High School is in New York. Okay? Where? Remember that question, please. Where? Okay, now. Tell me, please, Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, Iris, Leslie, who, who are the two famous students from La Guardia High School? Who are the two famous students? Jennifer Aniston and Al Pacino. And Al Pacino, perfect. They are the two famous students, okay? Very good, excellent. Now. What kind, what kind of a school is La Guardia? What kind of a school is La Guardia, guys? What kind of a school is it? First, what is the meaning of what kind? ¿Qué significa what kind? For example, A, what kind of music do you like? I like salsa, I like reggaeton, I like trap. What kind? What is the meaning of what kind? Mm. Um. ¿Qué tipo? Okay, what kind means ¿Qué tipo? Okay, so tell me please, what kind of a school is La Guardia, guys? What kind of a school is it? It's a math school, is a English school, is a, a cooking school, is a engineer school. What kind of a school is it, guys? Music. Only music. What more? Of music. A school of music. What more? Solo music? Only music? No. Dance. Theaters. Okay, okay. Um, Perfect okay. me? Almost, almost. Okay, music are excellent. Excellent, Melina. Excellent, Iris on the chat. Is a school of music are in? Perfect for me. 
Art. Art. Perfect. So, what kind of a school is La Guardia School? It's a school. Okay. It is. Remember, it is. It's a school of music, arts, and performing. Okay. Please, Stephanie, Leslie, pay attention because maybe you have a similar reading. Ah, tal vez tienen un similar reading. Pay attention, please. Now, let's see, guys. What kind, sorry, what school subjects, listen, ah, what school subjects do you have in La Guardia School? What school subjects do you have in La Guardia School, guys? What school subjects? English and math. English, math. What more, guys? Only English and math. What more? English, math. What more, guys? A school subjects. English, math. What more, guys? What more? English, math. What more, guys? A school subjects. Remember, please, remember the vocabulary. Come on, guys. School subjects. English, math. What more we have? School subjects. Art. Art. Perfect. English, math, art. What more? Theater. Theater. Perfect. Art. Theater. What more, guys? What more? School subjects. Music. Music and... Dance. Dance. So the school subjects in La Guardia School are English, math, theater, dance, music, art. Okay? Normal school subjects. Please participate. Yeah? It's reading comprehension, guys. Now, listen. When, when do the classes start, guys? When do the classes start? When do the classes start? When, when, what is the meaning of when, guys, in Spanish? When, when, when is your birthday? What is the meaning of when, guys? Cuando. Excellent. When do the classes start? What time do the classes start, guys? What time? When? Star, do the classes star? Nine. Nine. Mm, this is number nine, Melina. It's number nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Eight. The classes start at eight. Okay. And what time do the classes finish, guys? What time do the classes finish? Excellent, Iris. Activate, activate your microphone, Iris. Four? At four, okay? At 4 p.m., okay? Very good, thank you. Now, Mauricio, Iris, Leslie, your camera, please. Stephanie, Melina, let's see. Pay attention, please. Pay attention because maybe this article is in your exam. Tal vez esto les viene a su exam, ¿ah? Concentrate, please. What must, what must the students do? What must the students do in La Guardia School? What must do the students do in La Guardia School? What must have the students do? Guys, in La Guardia School. What are their obligations? What they must do, guys? Tell me, tell me. What must do they have to do, guys? What must do they do in the school, guys? What must? Must, necessary, obligation. What must do they have to do? 
Tell me, tell me. The answer is here. The, bu the building. Okay, okay. The building, okay, but. I must live with immediately. Okay, number one. Must live immediately. Immediately. Must show their ID cards. Excellent. Must show their ID cards. Okay. To enter. To enter the building. Okay, number one, must show the ID card. ID card, guys, means DNI, okay? DNI, ID card is DNA, okay? Number one, they must show their ID cards. Number two, Melina, help me, must? Must leave it immediately after, after their, the, the la, their last class. In your last class. Perfect. Now tell me, number three, what must do they have to do, guys? What must? They must not small any work okay. in the school. Uh, must, no massing, must. Uh, they must dress well. Dress well. Okay, they must dress well. Very good. Teacher Angelo, what is the meaning of dress well? Dress well. What is the meaning of dress, guys? ¿Qué significa dress? Dress. <clears throat> Dress. Arreglarse. Vestir. Okay. Vestir bien. Arreglarse bien. Okay. But very, very easy. Very similar, Melina. They must dress well. What more, guys? What more they must do? Show their ID cards. Leave immediately after classes. They must dress well. What more, guys? What more do they must do, guys? And tell me, tell me. Must show respect to teachers and other students. Excellent. Must show respect to teachers and other students. Okay? Very good. Pay attention, guys, here. And huh? pay attention, please. Okay? One, they must show their ID card. Two, they must leave immediately after the last class. Three, they must dress well. Four, they must show respect to the teacher. Okay? Now, question number... Next question, guys. Listen, huh? Mauricio, Stephanie, Iris, Melina. Listen, please. Leslie. What they must not, what they must not do in La Guardia School. What they must not do in La Guardia School. They mustn't, must not do, guys. They must not smoke anywhere in the school. Excellent. They must not smoke anywhere in the school. What more, guys? What more? They must work up if they want to become stars of the future. Okay, okay. Almost perfect, Melina. Let's see. The answer is here uh, in paragraph number three. La respuesta está en el paragraph number three, guys. They must and smoke, okay, is prohibited. What more is prohibited, guys? What more is prohibited? Mustn't, must not. What more is prohibited? Tell me, tell me. Must not use cell phones of parts in class of Donald music for the school computers. Excellent, okay. Thank you. Students must not, must not use cell phone. Okay, cell phone for Twitter, to the TikTok, okay, must not use cell phone or download music, okay, guys. This is a famous word. What is the meaning of download, guys? Download music. Cargando? Descargar, okay, descargando. Very similar, okay. They must not use cell phone, must not download music, download music, or must not smoke okay so stephanie mauricio liz uh, leslie iris 
Do you have any question about it, guys? Alguna pregunta about mass and about this reading comprehension, guys? Questions, questions, yes or no? Yes, no, no. Now, come on, guys. The, the, the answer of the equations are very easy. Ah, las respuestas están súper fáciles. Acá bien clarito dice, más. Acá bien clarito dice, más. Acá bien clarito dice, art, music, dance, theater, English, math. Acá dice, where is? Is in New York. Acá mismo lo dice, chicos. In New York. What kind of school is it? ¿Qué tipo? Ah, it's a famous school of music, art, and performing art. ¿Ok? Who are the famous people? ¿Quiénes son los famous? Jennifer Aniston. ¿Ok? Jennifer Aniston from Six, Six Ago. Fuegos de Hambre. Six Ago, algo así. En Al Pacino. ¿Ok? So, the answers are here, guys. Reprobada. <laughs> okay, it is. Let's see, guys. So, listen, please. Before we do the exam, antes que hagamos el exam, okay? Let's see, let's see. Let me see how, guys, here. Pay attention here, please. Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, Iris, Leslie. Here you have five questions, okay? We answer these five questions orally. Hemos respondido estos five questions orally. Okay, you need to answer these five questions in your notebooks. Okay, it's not necessary to print out the paper. Es no necesario que lo impriman. You can answer in your notebook. Lo pueden responder directo en su cuaderno. English notebook. Okay, what, uh, what school subjects? What kind of school? Who are the famous students? What must and what mustn't do the students? Okay, you answer these questions in your notebook, guys. Lo responden en su notebook, ¿ok? So, Melina, Mauricio, Stephanie, Iris, any question before your exam, guys? ¿Alguna pregunta? Tell me, tell me now, or be in silence forever. No questions, guys? No questions? No? Ok. Listen, I'm gonna give you the assistant, ¿ok? One minute, please, enter to your assistant, give a click to your name, please, guys.